A cargo is growing in popularity as a medium choice when it's using to shipping a sensitive goods, perishable goods, documentation, information from one place to another. A cargo, it can get the shipment to its overseas destination with, between one day with many instances it has become the important part of the global logistic chain. Air cargo refer to the act of using an air carrier as the transportation for shipment purpose. For the process of export, goods are unloaded from the truck and arranged on the pallet. Agent assigned by the company will check on the goods. Once checking is done, the goods are being scanned for safety purpose. After being scanned, the goods are arranged back on the pallet. While that, the agent will go to the customs to do clearance. For the export documentation, we use K2, K2 cheat, packing list, invoices, and delivery order. Then the agent will paste a sticker as a remark that the goods have been declared and ready to be export. It is then arranged on the baggage and being attached to the tow tractor. The tow tractor bring the baggage to the air freight and load it in into the flight by using drivable conveyor belt loader. In import, the first process will be unloading the goods from the flight using drivable conveyor belt loader and arrange it into the baggage. The baggage is then attached to the tow tractor. The tow tractor will pull the baggage into the warehouse. Once it is in the warehouse, the goods will be arranged on the pallet and counting will be done. The agent assigned by the company will check on the goods in terms of the quantity, types of goods and whether there is any tax applicable or not. Next, the agent will do the clearance at the custom. This is the type of documentation using during the clearance. We use K1, K1 cheat, master packing list, delivery order and invoices. Agent will then assist the warehouse manpower to arrange the good into the lorry. Logistic is concerned with the organization, movement, storage of material and people. It concerns of combination of planning and control of the flow of material in organization. The main objective is to deliver the right materials to the right place at the right time while optimizing the total cost of operational process. <laughs>